Before you enjoy the video, I would like to mention that over 85% of my viewers aren't subscribed. If you're part of 85%, consider subscribing as it helps me grow, thus producing better and more content for everybody. I would also like to mention that I'm doing a big giveaway once we reach 500 subscribers, so let's all get together and reach the goal. Without further ado, enjoy the video. How's it going ladies and gentlemen my name is Smojo I just want to say thank you for watching the video hope you're having an amazing day and uh, yeah let's get into it so this is going to be a new type of series that I want to do on my channel basically I take uh wizard 101 card concepts and just talk about them uh would they be a good card try to get the community's feedback anything like that if you have any cards that you would like to show or have any ideas that you would like to share uh feel free to join my discord down below in the description just hop in there you know send the card picture or uh this would be a cool card if we could do this that and the other you know just share your ideas or any uh pictures of cards that you have and uh yeah so the first card we're going to show is this one right here it's a pretty cool uh storm card uh, i don't know how to pronounce the name i believe it goes by a char this charb cherry cherry bis cherry i don't know okay it, it looks like a it looks like the, the bermuda triangle all right we're just gonna call it triangle for now because that's what the, the, the picture looks like right at the back is a, it's a pretty interesting card i must say it's a 10 pip storm card it does 1300 damage and it reshuffles your hand back into your deck which is is, is pretty interesting uh i think the only way that i will personally use this card is if i'm pveing trying to level up my storm pveing um, I'm alone. There's no other wizards there but me. Um, I'm down to my last hand, and I think this would be a really cool card to have. You know, there's I I personally own a 130 storm, and throughout my uh, leveling career on that 130 storm, I had uh, lots of lots of battles where I would hit and I wouldn't kill, and I didn't have any more hits in my deck, and it's it's super annoying because what are you gonna do then? You know, uh, you can either buy a media and a crown shot, but what if you don't have any crowns? You know, or what if you don't have any gold and then you ask your friends, hey, I need some help, I'm about to die. You know, but what if you don't have any friends? Lol. Uh, there's there's really nothing you can do. You can, you can rely on TC, but what if you didn't pack it? You know, this card helps you with that. You know, you can hit something and then you get all the cards back into your deck, which I think is really really cool. I also think it's kind of vital because if you have a reshuffle in your deck, which is uh, cost about four pips i believe uh, if you're not a balanced wizard and you have four power pips that's eight pips cons considering you know that that doesn't hit anything this is 10 pips right here we're comparing 10 pips to eight pips and 1300 damage i think i'd rather spend 10 pips do 1300 damage hopefully i will kill the boss and if i don't i just get my cars right back it's a lot better than hitting you know ha having to spend a lot of pips hitting not killing and then you have to rebuild your pips back up so you can use a reshuffle you know where that's about what three or so rounds between that of you hitting and, and having to build pips up to to use reshuffle again you know i think this card could really come in handy if it was a real card um i do have some comments i did post this on reddit if you guys want to you know check out the reddit or whatnot it will be down in the description but i did post this on reddit try to get some people's feedback on what they think about the card uh one person said i don't think it'll be worth it uh max pip tempest four more pips uh, has about the same base damage and it's an aoe but there's also triton a six pip spell that does like eight to nine hundred damage he also then said why wait for former pips the damage difference uh isn't especially huge uh when crits and buffs will be more than enough now he does have a point i will i will admit he does have a point when when you have buffs and you have crits uh more than likely you're going to kill what you're trying to kill but there are there are instances when you hit you underestimate yourself or you underestimate the boss and their resistance might be too high or they placed a, a tower shield right before it was your turn to hit you know or maybe they healed right before your turn to hit and then you hit with everything you had you had a bunch of blades up you know boss had a fight or whatever you know you, you tried to hit as hard as you could but it just wasn't enough and now you don't have enough hits in your deck and uh you're, you're fucked like i said i think it, it, the, the, the fact that you are allowed to reshuffle your hand back into your deck after you hit is really really good that's the only reason why i think this card be vital if it only had the 1300 damage and it was a 10 pip card it would not be worth it we have storm out that is a whole lot more damage than this one all right and it, you know that i rather use storm out than use something that does 600 less damage than than storm out another person said uh make it a uh, 1200 then yeah it's a good card i have to disagree De like decreasing the damage on this card i personally don't think is a is a good idea if anything i would like to see the card increase in damage maybe like a 
like a 1400 or maybe a 1500 not a big increase you know but i do think it's a little bit on the weaker side and i do understand that you reshuffle your deck back in hand which is really good for the card and why anybody would use it but i still think it's 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 pretty weak like let's just take this into account you have two cards in hand uh they both cost 10 pips you have this card and then you have storm owl uh you, you're bladed up you're fighted up the boss is at full health you know you're trying to kill this boss which card are you going to use are you going to use the 1300 or are you going to use storm owl i personally would use storm owl it does more damage i have a better chance at killing it in one shot it just overall makes a lot more sense if the damage of this card was increased i would think a little bit more back and forth would i use that storm owl or would i use this card you know let's say this card did 1600 damage and storm owl did 1800 damage that's really close in damage there's not there's not much uh, room for for breathing in a, in a difference of damage right there so when i think about killing something you know, i'm gonna think about if i hit will i kill and if i don't think i will kill i think it would be better for me to hit with this card so i can reshuffle my cards back into my deck so that i have a better chance at killing once i hit versus hitting with a storm owl and you're not you're, you're not confident enough that you're going to kill and then after you hit with that storm owl what do you do then you know, there, there's no, there's not much you can do at that point if you don't have any cards all right guys that's all that i want to say about the card it's a pretty cool card uh the person who made the card i actually don't know who made the card but i will link it down in the description where i personally found the card uh hopefully where i found it is the person who made it but you know fingers crossed whoever made the card awesome card uh the artwork is amazing i really like the effort and time that you put into it so kudos to you if you guys have any card ideas that you would like for me to see or do a review on please let me know in the discord just you know join send a message dm me find me on twitter wh wherever you can find me and send me information go for it other than that i hope you guys enjoyed the video thank you for watching please leave a like comment and subscription uh we're doing a pretty solid giveaway once we hit 500 subscribers on youtube so hopefully we get there and the giveaway happens so yeah other than that have a great day everybody and i will see you next time Ba -da -ba -boom.